What's up guys, it's me your badass host Draven and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. Okay, so we finally made it to Cerulean City. That was the goal. And I think we are like right there. We're borderline right there for where we left off over in uh in Heart Gold. Now in our last episode, we went through the power plant, and apparently there is somebody loitering around, you know, near the gym and all that stuff. I wonder if this guy is the guy, and he's like, a shady character sneaked into the gym. What business does he have with Misty? Hmm, I wonder what that is. So let's see, what, what, what business does this guy have? And we're walking in, and BAM! Bumps into us, and he's gonna be like, Oops, I'm so sorry. You not hurt, okay? I'm very busy. No time talking with you, not good for me if seen by somebody. And well, I've already seen him, so he's like, Oh no! You see me already? I make big mistake. Hey you, forget you see me, okay? You see, you heard none, no, nothing. Bye. Bye bye, go go. Oh wow. Okay, so uh, yeah, there's a. Uh, yeah, he, 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 he's a, he, he's a bit of an odd character now. We can't cross anything right here, and apparently I don't have a Pokemon with Surf, so let's go with the storyline right here, okay? So, he has escaped, and this guy, let's see, what does this guy have to say? I saw the shady guy go back in, in black, go towards the cape, so we're going to have to go there. Now, Cerulean City, home to water-type Pokemon trainers and Misty herself. And, of course, the Cerulean Cave has still been around for quite some time. It, it is now open, and, uh, well, if you go right here, you talk to this guy, he's going to be like, I heard a cave here had a horribly powerful Pokemon in it, that's why I came here. Hmm? My dowsing machine is responding. Now, I want to know what this is all about, so I'm going to turn on the dowsing machine, and... Yeah, there's something right there. And, uh, well, eventually we're going to have to get to it when we get to it, but right now, we're going to have to go through a mission. And here is what was called the Nugget Bridge at Route 24. And our good old buddy's just going to barge in onto this couple. He's going to be like, Who is this guy in black coming between me and my girlfriend? Who are you? Well, let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go, uh, you know, it's time for us to just, uh, time to get our Pokemon leveled up and all that stuff because, well, we got a gym battle ready, like, really like in, in the horizon right here. And, well, I was, or Heidi was, but you did me, found me no time, uh, me, only one from another country. Yet, no big business, okay? I think I did, if stopped the energy, big the be big panic and lucky for here people secret is my mission so tell you nigh not but if you win versus me a man I, I be mine secret do you tell okay I'm not even let's go let's go right ahead and battle because this guy is seriously you need to learn how to speak so we're gonna battle this guy who's been kicking our butt and there we go confusion yeah we just beat him with one guy and all that stuff okay tell you mine secret I will machine part steal by me hide it I did in the gym cerulean near inflatable tube. Put it I did look for a gym at, but you forget me not. Beat you for sure will Team Rocket. Come from Johto, will they? Mine allies, yes. Will revenge they are. Okay, so he is now realizing that it's like, wait, Team Rocket's done? Yes, I ended Team Rocket. You say what? Team Rocket bye-bye? A go-go? Broken up it says you? Oh no! Should I do what now on uh, from me? Okay, my country, I my country go home. Make Team Rocket, I will. Goodbye, so long. Okay, so that right there was that, and uh, well, we got business to attend to, so I'll be right back with you when it comes to. Trying to find a Pokemon to surf, so I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so we got our Pokemon, and now it is time for us to locate this this whole part right here. So if you go ahead and surf right here, guys, you'll be able to find yourself a, the tube that this guy hit it. And, well, it looks like to me it might be right here in one of these tubes. So let's see, right there? Hmm, not right there, huh? How about right here? So let's see, Deep Blue Sea... And, uh, you know, this is a, th this right here is a job for our dowsing machine, so let's see. Nothing, huh. Nothing, okay, so what if we go right here? Huh, what do I hear? Okay, so, there it is, we picked up the item, and there it is. We found ourselves the machine part, which will actually enable us to 
go back to, you know, go back to the power plant. And look at this. Gym Leader Draven. Take it over. That's right. Anywho, I'm going to skip forward and I'm going to go straight to, uh, what was it called? Uh, I'm going to go straight back to the power plant. That way we can settle this whole thing and then we can get back to it. So I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, guys. So here we are back into the power plant. And all we need to do now is go straight to the, uh, well, the, the director. And he is going to be ecstatic. He's going to be like, ah, yeah, the thing you have. Is that the part that was stolen from my beloved generator? You found it. Thank you so much. Now, all I have to do is this, attach this part here, and, uh, well, would you look at this, guys, bam, everything is moving, turning, everything is on, yes, sir, all right, well, wow, thanks, here, go ahead and take this TM as a reward, and we get ourselves the TM57, which is charge beam, and if you guys don't know, I've already gotten that TM and gave it to our good old buddy, what's his name, uh, a fluff bolt and all that, so here is Charge Beam. It will shoot down beams and it can also raise, sometimes raise the special attack of the Pokemon. So that right there has been covered. And well, everything is back to normal. So now what we need to do is we need to go back to Cerulean City because we got a gym battle that we need to get to. And uh, we need to get to... Yeah, we, we really need to get there badly, so I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so here we are back, guys, in Cerulean City. Everything is working, and now it is finally time for us to progress right here in Route 24, because, uh, yeah, we, we, we need to get to our next gym battle. And as many of you guys already know, Route 25, Route 24 is going to be home to a whole bunch of trainers, especially the Nugget Bridge people, which will progress close to the cottage, near Bill's Cottage and all that stuff. So as you guys can see, beat the six of us trainers and win a fabulous prize. Think you got what it takes? I do. Okay, so we're going to be speeding through this because, well, yes, we want to get to Misty. We want to destroy her. We want to win. We gotta win, damn it! Okay, so here we go, taking on another trainer. And Wigglytuff is coming. Let's go with a, a extra sensory. I can't even see it right. And here comes Double Edge. Now, Double Edge is a very strong move. 100 accuracy, power is great, but the problem is this Pokemon's attack is not all there. And the goal is to try and evolve it with his, with his stone. So we're not, gonna, we're not gonna learn that move just yet. And what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go straight to Hercules. And we're going to go straight for a brick break right there. And here we go. Brick break for the win. And Professor Oak is calling us. He's going to be like, hello, this is Professor Oak. Your Pokedex is filling up quickly. Okay, so that was awkward. Never mind. Okay, so let's go right ahead and start battling some more trainers right here. Obviously, these people were from the... I, I would like to say they were from, what was it called? Uh, the... The Nugget Bridge, and right now I'm just getting my butt kicked, but look at this, we win. And here comes a Vaporeon. They were part of the Nugget Bridge, but now they're mo moving into this whole area right here, because I don't know why. And, well, look at that, we just defeated them. What happens in three years, I do not know. But let's go right ahead and go with the full restore right here. And, uh, well, maybe it's time for us to actually switch up our Pokemon, because, well, you yeah. know. We need a we need to progress, especially with Fluff Volt. We need this Pokemon to be strong enough for the next gym battle. And here we have a challenger. Okay, I'm number four. I'll stomp you. Okay, so here we have number four, and yeah, he, he wasn't kidding. He's gonna stomp us. So let's go right ahead and straight to our good old buddy Nessie and go with a waterfall attack for the win. And just like that, we win. And I gotta see something right here. So we go back here, and yeah, you can actually go straight for Pokemon. That's pretty cool. All right, so let's move on right here and continue on with the battles. And I I see a double battle happening. You know what? Let's go ahead. Good combination. Let's bring him over, and let's see what happens. Six Pokemon in all. All righty. Discharge won't affect uh, our good old buddy, but that will. So Stone Edge for the win. Discharge, it actually does affect us. Holy crud, okay, so never mind. Okay, so let's go with a signal beam onto this guy. Let's go with a, this right here. There we go. And look at that, level 53 Cinder. Learning double edge. So let's go right ahead and take away Swift for just right now. And Blossom is there. So let's go straight for another 
another, uh, what was it called? Uh, another, uh, I can't remember the name of the beam. Signal beam, yeah, there it is. Okay, we're getting paralyzed. Holy crud, okay, so there we go. And just like that, we're winning. And Stone Edge for the win. And here comes two more Pokemon. Let's go for a Charge Beam attack right here. And... You know what? Screw it. Crunch attack. Let's go. And just like that, we defeat another Pokemon train. And bam. Yes, we win. Okay. So, let's go right ahead. Let's go right ahead and heal up our Pokemon because, well, we took a, quite a few damage right here. And, you know what? It's probably a good thing that we, we, we are using the speed button because, well, this would have taken a long time. Now, I believe this is the area where... Yeah. What the heck? Can't go there. Okay, never mind. This guy has nothing to do with the battles, but he just wants to see what's a, what this is all about. So let's go with a discharge. And just like that, we win. Super nerd got his butt kicked. Okay, so... Yeah, we can skip this guy. He's not going to be doing anything much, but he's like, you took, one, you took on one more battle than you expected, but hey, you won anyways. As promised, you win a prize. And we get ourselves a nugget, which, you know, you can actually use for more money and all that stuff. And we get an extra battle, so let's go right ahead and do that. So here it is, another battle, and we do not have that the move set for this, so let's go straight for Nessie. And Waterfall for the win. There it is, and Charmeleon's coming back. And just like that, we're kicking some butt, taking some names. Going with Flavol, and... Oh, wow. Yeah, that's what happens when you use the speed button. You don't really check on the moves, and wow, we're getting our butts kicked right now. But we win anyways. Look at that. Fluffle defeated. Okay, so we had a good battle. And yes, we are really, really strong. So here we are in front of the co uh, Bill's Cottage. And let's see. Bill's Cottage, Sea Cottage. If you guys remember a few episodes ago, Bill's relative said that their grandpa now lives here. And he's like, hmm, you are here for my grandson. His name is Bill. He's in Johto. He does something with PCs. So I'm house sitting. Ah, oh, my grandson mentioned a round, uh, a round blue Pokemon that, that has leaves growing on its head. Round blue Pokemon with leaves growing on its head. Oh, I know what it is. If you have that Pokemon, can I see it, please? Now, if you talk to this guy and you show him the Pokemon that, you know, he has or that he requests, he's going to give you some special items and stuff. Now, it's time to, uh, yeah, time to, time to mess up somebody's day. As you guys can see right here, Misty is uh, having a day right now, and this guy's like, nope. Nope, 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 nope. I don't want to be seen. And Misty's a little like, oh, why'd you have to go and show up like that or show up and bug us now? Do you know what they call people like you? Pest. You heard me right. Pest. Oh, those badges you have. Are they Johto Gym badges? If you have eight, you must be good. Okay, then. Come to the Cerulean Gym. I'll be happy to take you on. I'm Misty, the gym leader of Cerulean. She called us Pest. Holy crap. Okay. So, that right there covers everything. I mean, sort of kind of everything, but yes. You know what, let's go ahead and get on our bike right here. So yes, we have completed everything right here in Cerulean City. We can now battle Misty for our sixth, or our fifth badge. Yeah, our fifth badge in Kanto, so you guys do not want to miss that. And believe it or not, it's going to be matching. It's not really going to be matching, but it's going to be, we're going to be in line. Yeah, we're going to be in line with, uh, what was it, with our previous Pokemon uh, Heart Gold walkthrough. So you guys do not want to miss this. Thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being supportive as always. If you guys want merch or anything like that from the official gym, uh, Gym Leader Draven uh, merch site, it's right down there below. I'll be back for another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold walkthrough, or Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. Jesus, can't even speak right. See you guys.